What do you think, Yamagishi? Do you sense anything? Any luck, sister? No. <sighs> and of course, she is refusing to speak. By refusing to speak, you're only hurting yourself. We aren't trying to keep you hostage. We just want to avoid unnecessary confrontation. How's Shidori? Junpei, didn't we tell you to stay in the waiting room? You're back again. Why are you so hung up on her, Junpei? Did she say anything? What's the point? She didn't say a word. Let me talk to her. Yori. You're getting really emotionally invested in this. Is everything all right? Well, I know she attacked me, but I don't know. I, I just can't get her out of my head. Please, let me do this. Junpei-kun. What's got it into you, Junpei? Ah, <sighs> jeez. Mm. Desperate times call for desperate measures, I suppose. All right, see if you can get through to her. Got it. You okay? <sighs> I'm glad they let you keep your sketchbook. Wow, you're still drawing pictures? Even in the hospital? You really do like to draw, huh? <gasps> it doesn't matter. She spoke to him. She finally spoke. Only I can understand my drawings. Wait, Chidori, your arm, it's bleeding. What the hell? Again? Die, not again. Yamagishi, get the doctor. Sure thing. All right. What happened? Why are you bleeding? She does it to herself. I thought I took all the sharp objects in here. She did this to herself? Apparently we can't leave her unattended for even a moment. But at the very least, she seems to heal at an astonishing rate. Let, let go of me! Then, that cut on your hand back at the station, you did that to yourself? I never asked for you to worry about me. You were the one who jumped to conclusions. Well, I want you to stop. You can't be doing that. I'm not just saying this because I'm worried about you. I don't want to see you hurting yourself. All right? The doctor will be here soon. You should head back. Yeah, you should head back. Right. So... You seem to have found your voice. <sighs> and of course, she is not speaking. <sighs>